They were told it was impossible. Even their own father, a bishop, said flight was reserved for angels. On December 17, 1903, in Kitty Hawk, North Carolina, a bicycle shop duo from Ohio prepared to prove the world wrong. No college degrees, no government funding, just an obsession with one problem, control. While others built flying coffins that crashed on takeoff, Orville and Wilbur Wright studied birds. They built a wind tunnel in their shop, testing nearly 200 wing designs. Their breakthrough was wing warping, finally allowing a pilot to steer the sky. With a custom engine built by mechanic Charlie Taylor, Orville took the controls. For 12 seconds and 120 feet, humanity flew. By day's end, Wilbur pushed it to 59 seconds. It wasn't just a flight, it was the birth of the modern world. From a dirt track in North Carolina to the surface of the moon, just 66 years later. The Wright brothers, the men who taught the world to fly.